there and welcome back. I'm Shri, the co-founder of Piper, and in this video we're going to be talking about phase one, the build. In this first phase, students will build a fully functioning computer by constructing the case and connecting components, including a screen, the Raspberry Pi A+, battery, and more. The kit is complete with a large engineering blueprint that serves as step-by-step -step visual instructions to build the computer. Since the Piper Blueprint doesn't include much text, our first learning objective is for learners to understand engineering diagrams as instructions. Students are encouraged to work in pairs or small groups to collaborate effectively and work on their problem-solving skills to build their Piper computer kit. We recommend two students to one Piper, but one-to-one -one or three-to-one work well as well. And the Piper Computer Kit fits into its own box for easy classroom storage. Another quick tip, make sure that you keep the batteries charging until phase two, when you can hand them out to your students for use. And overall, keep in mind that the goal here is to build confidence and some basic skills collaboratively. Part of the Piper experience is to encourage productive struggle, so don't give the students answers. All of the instructions needed are a part of the experience, and troubleshooting is where some of the best learning outcomes are derived. We've built our resources to help your students in this process as well. Check out phase one on our premium curriculum. We've developed four lesson plans with established goals, lesson times, prep, and 5E model alignment, as well as a ton of resources on the left side panel. Be sure to check out the career connections, the real, tangible ways in which the skills your students learn can translate to the real world. Check out the facilitation guide and our curriculum for more resources about Phase 1. Thanks for joining, and see you on the next video.